about this because tis the season right now for a great carving knife. And we have it for you right here for one of the biggest names when it comes to kitchen, Cuisinart, the electric knife. We're not only gonna give you the electric knife though, it comes with two blades. You're also going to get your fork with this as well so you can get that nice prime rib and hold it still. You get the stand for the, uh, the power. And then look at this, we're even gonna give you a little carving board and storage tray as well, all of it. $49.95, because we're doing the countdown to Black Friday, we're doing uh, six flex payments on everything. $8.33 to get this home and free shipping and handling. One of the our favorite product <laughs> presenters, Aww. Mr. Mark Gill. Hi, everybody. Is slicing up a little breakfast bread for us. Well, and I'll tell you, the very first thing I want you to do once you order this is run, don't walk to the bakery section. Because one of the true joys of owning an electric knife is the job that it does on bread. And listen, because it's Cuisinart, you know not only are you going to have the power, but you're going to have control unlike any electric knife you've ever worked with. You've never seen anything do that fast and that easy. And there's some real big time reasons for it. So let let me go ahead and take you on a tour of this knife and some of the reasons you're going to love it. Now, first things first, let's look at it right there. Please and art. That's yeah. all you really need to know. Guys, they stand behind their products. They've been doing it right since mm -hmm. 1972. Now, the blades themselves are removable, uh, removable for easy cleanup, which I love. You pop them right back in. Now, the power button's right there, but you know what? It doesn't work unless you hit the safety button. And that is really one of the nice features. Hit the safety button and hit that blade. And that's all you really need to know. And what's cool about this, you mentioned it. The holidays are, are not coming up. Right. They're, They're here. here. <laughs> <laughs> so here's the thing, you guys. Dad didn't want to cut that uh, you know holiday turkey because it was some sort of rite of passage or some sort of dad thing. It's because he got to play with the electric knife. It's like a power <laughs> tool in the kitchen. So if you're thinking like the remote control. <laughs> that this isn't going to give you the those paper thin slices, I got news for you. And what's great about this, Alice, and what I really love about it, is that a lot of times people like electric knife, electric knife, that's what grandpa had, that's what dad had. I gotta tell you something, if you're a foodie, wait till you see some of the cuts that you're able to perform now because you have the right tools. And take it from somebody who knows, nothing makes mm. you look better when you know, you know you're not really sure than having the right tools. And here's what I love about an electric knife at holiday time. This skin is crispy, it's gonna snap, but watch this. All you do is touch and cut. The skin never snaps, the skin never breaks. When it comes to bread, it doesn't matter if it's soft, hard, crusty, Italian, makes no difference at all. This knife is designed to go exactly where you point it at. No pressure is necessary, no sawing back and forth. All you get is clean, perfect cuts every single time. And I, you know what, all you gotta do is read the reviews on these. People yes. are in love with this electric knife. And all you really need to do, and all you really need to see <laughs> is the way that he actually carved Isn't that beautiful? soft bread, okay? Without any ripping, without any tearing whatsoever. Look at that. Amazing. He's, you sculpted bread <laughs> with this knife. I'll do a cat next time. Six flex payments of $8.33. <laughs> you will want this. You will need this. Absolutely. And most importantly, you will use this. But you're getting the carving board. You're getting the fork. You're getting the two knives. Every you're getting little. a storage. You're getting all of it Cuisinart quality. We are simulcasting live on Facebook. So if you have any questions or just want to say hi, we'd love to hear from you. Now, here's one of the things that I really want you to notice the difference of, okay? We put a 130 watt motor in ours. The average electric knife out there, we looked about 80 to 90. That's a huge difference. And have a look at our blades. If you've ever had an electric knife before, you know that they're thin, they're flimsy. This looks like a chef's knife. So why did we put all that power and all this blade into this knife? Because I want my foodie friends out there to understand that these knives are for you. They're not for grandma anymore. They're not for dad. They're not just wow. for you know, grandpa. They're for my foodie friends because there's nothing else out there that's going to give you the ability on your next brunch to go ahead and take that pineapple, <gasps> core it out, put some fruit inside, and serve it like that in the bowl. Or now, grill it on. Or grill, grill it. it. Just slap that on the grill. <laughs> exactly. Oh my gosh, it's so good. It's now crazy. have a look at this. We're going to go from really hard to really soft. If you've ever worked with soft, warm mozzarella cheese, then you know it can crease, it can shred. All I do is touch and cut. That's it. And I'm going to show you here how thin these slices can really be. A lot of times people think it's just for bread, it's just for meat. So I'm gonna pause for a second, I want you to see this. That's amazing. That's the real deal. An electric knife mm -hmm. just did that with no creasing and no tearing. And let's switch back from super soft to something you wouldn't expect. And this is the 130 watts of power that I keep talking about. So instead of running that avocado so close oh. to your hand to get the pit out, why don't you just let the electric <laughs> knife do? And again, look at, look at how 
how smooth the avocado, the soft avocado Isn't is. Isn't that smooth beautiful? As silk. That's how good this this knife is. You need this knife. Forty nine ninety five. If you have resisted in the past because oh, you know what, I can just cut it. It just doesn't work like this one does. Nothing works this like works this. so beautifully. And uh, Thomas said, good morning. Happy Saturday. <laughs> Hi, Thomas. Hi, Thomas. Love it. I have a check here. Uh, Thomas, I got a really neat trick for you. Next time you go and do like a salad, you've got cherry tomatoes. I, I love this one. And again, this is something that I would normally do with a great big long slicing knife. But because I have the power and because I have the control of this, now I can do it with an electric knife. And all you do is just let that knife run right through those tomatoes between two plates and instead of all of that work, That's instead of crazy. all of that chopping, how about you do it all at once and get everything done right? Now, this is for you get, everybody, where else you guys. Do you get kitchen tricks like that, <laughs> except from this Isn't guy on HSN, because that it. is pretty darn clever. Uh, we do also have this is the black, but we also have red available. Unfortunately, we don't have one on the set with us, but uh, you can see a picture of a, on HSN.com if you would like to. But um, if you if you carve one roast, if you <laughs> carve that turkey, you spend all that money on it. But right. You will use this for your cheeses for your soft things for your bread stop ripping shredding tearing and instead see this is why when you go to the barbecue barbecue places right why they have that sharp cut it's because they use electric knives exactly and if i can share a little hint for uh, a little uh just kind of quip with you this roast costs more than the knife. Wow. And my point with that is if you're gonna spend the time, the energy, the money, if you're gonna invite people to your home for the holidays, make sure that that cut is picture perfect. Because you know what? Ooh. Why not? We have the stuff to do it now. We have all the tools to do it. Everything's quick, everything's easy, everything's within our grasp. Even the great big sandwiches that we love to make with turkey and giant breads just fly right through it, come leftovers and everything. Okay, watch this. This is one of my favorite, so favorite fabulous. demonstrations to show people. Because what I love about this, this knife is the great equalizer. This takes everything that all of you know us kitchen folk spent years learning with knife skills and what to do and how to cut and how to properly do it. You know what? If you can squeeze a trigger now, you've got all of these incredible knife skills, like being able to make something like this that you just simply at the end of it stuff with a little bacon and a little cream cheese, mm -hmm. roll it right back up, bake it at about 350, and you've got an incredible rolled beautiful roast that just, you know, like I said, it's picture book perfect. You just I love can't them. do it with a manual knife. And you know, most of us don't have good knife schools. You don't need anything. All you need is a plug so you can plug this in. It is a great knife. It's going to work so beautifully. You can sculpt soft. I, I want to just show you how soft this bread is. Okay. <laughs> the bread is fresh. All right. So it's soft. Isn't that beautiful? Look at how he sculpted that bread. Perfectly. Even the crumbs know better than to jump off. Works, but if, I don't <laughs> care if you're. If again, this is for so many things other than just a turkey and exactly. a roast. Exactly. Well, I'll tell you what. Do you like sandwiches? I'm a huge sandwich I love fan. Love sandwiches. Let's make a sandwich out of ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> this is one of the things I that I want you to coming. do with your kids, right? <laughs> Next time you have a party, give this a whirl. You're going to love it. <laughs> Grab your favorite ice cream, just uh, the small size. That's all you need to do. You are not. And remember, 130 watts <laughs> means it really doesn't matter how frozen this is. It's going to pop right through it. Don't try this with one of those knives with 70 or 80 watts. So here's what you're going to do. You're going to take that one cookie. You're going to put it on the bottom. Give it a little cut there. And then just set it on top. <laughs> There we go. Are we ready for this one? Okay. That is probably one of the That's funnest things you're ever going to do. Yeah, I want that. Hey, quick question from Sabira. Can this cut through a whole watermelon? Oh, absolutely. In fact, uh, let me wander over to the pineapple here one more time because that is a great question. Can it cut through a whole pineapple? You no. know what? Uh, oh, I'm sorry, watermelon. watermelon. And I've got to bring one on set because I do get asked that. So let me show you this one more time. Just the power of this knife. This is the reason that we made the blades like chef's knives instead of little twigs. And this is also the reason we gave it a 130 watt motor so you know you got the tool for the job. Look at that clean <laughs> cut. This is Isn't great. I like sandwiches. Callie, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I had to do the heavy lifting over here. <laughs> it's okay. I'm just over here decorating some holiday cookies for the contest tonight in Shannon's show. Mm. Check it out. Oh, oh, oh. It's a little bit much. Mm. I'm all about the frosting, but I'm very jealous because all those things look so good. That's a great little night. For everything, I didn't think about some of the things that Mark came up with. Ice cream, oh. sandwich. Oh my God, this is, this is crazy. <laughs>